Hello and welcome back to Pantheon of the Geeks. This is part two of the Magic 2015 playthrough that I'm doing. Um, this is where I'm going to go into the single player mode. But just before I do that, just a quick look at the options screen. You can see it's single player, multiplayer, shop, decks, card collections, help and options, player profile, store locator and extras. So that's how it's presented in this version. It's quite nice to navigate. It's obviously very nice art style. I like this art style. It's really cool. Um, so here we are into the campaign. So so I'm going to start from scratch. We'll get the basic cards into fighting living death. Apparently, so here we go. We'll see how well we do. You can watch me fail if I fail. Appears to be playing a water and death deck. I wasn't aware it was a joint deck, but it's water and death. Um, so he's me opening hand, seven cards, got three land cards in there. Um, it's a two cast creature. That's quite a higher level one, so that will destroy type creature. That's quite a good spell, I'll keep all that. I'll keep the hand as it is. And we'll see how we go. Throwing out a land straight away though. Living Death, obviously playing Death and Swamps and doing the same as me. Um, so I've got Mind Rot, Tag Fly, this card's two cards. Take a photo of that, I'll throw another Land out and a Beastie. Throw a Zombie out, Walking Corpse. We got here, walking corpse. So just matching my moves at the moment, really. Um, continue. So we got Kraken Hatchling, but again, I'd need some Water Island on the cards. Um, but I don't have any. Could use Mind Rot at this point. Dark Play has to discard two cards. Could do that because there's nothing better to do. Or I could leave it for now. I'm gonna leave it for now. So let's see what happens. So they're coming into attack, are they? Or am I going? No, it's been my turn. I have to get used to how this looks. It all looks very cool. I do like the look of it. I like the style. Um, I find it a bit hard to click some of the options for blocking. As you probably saw me frustratingly trying to click in the tutorial at times. So I'm going to have to get used to Again, I'm only used to playing the actual card game, not the computer game. So um, we're not going to attack with that. We're just going to skip the attack this turn. I like the way it opens up in the middle as well. That's quite cool. Makes you know you're definitely in the attack phase. So let's, uh, let's get on with stuff. Not much has happened so far. It's been pretty dull. So, is she going to attack? No, she's got the same mindset as me. Uh, a carrion crow, unfortunately. I wish I had a full black deck there. <laughs> Why did I choose blue? I always choose black. I thought it would be slightly different than choose blue. I didn't realise it was going to be a mixed deck. I thought it was going to be an all blue deck. So, imagine my shock. No, I can't play half my cards. Can't really do anything. I'll play my board. Make a discard a couple of cards. A really good ones. A land and whatever that was. Completed dead. Oh, I suppose if that can destroy my land, that's probably best she didn't have it. So let's uh, skip the attack phase because there doesn't see much point. Beaten up by a carrion crow this turn. There's nothing I can do about it at all. There we go. Ah, oh, I got a water card. Brilliant. Got the island card. I will refer to them as like water and stuff. Uh, let's get a heron out there because it's a flying card. I 
can block that other flyer that she's got. Attack, not yet. Another swamp card comes out. Um, is she going to attack? No. Nope. Doesn't want to lose her beasties either. Oh, massive ghouls, great. Fabulous. Oh, hate them. Also, it's playing black. <laughs> Okay, so what's this? Tribute to hunger, your target opponent sacrifices a creature, you gain life equal to that target toughness. Uh let's make let's make them do that, eh? Right? Gives me full life again. And let's get a blocker out. May as well. Attack. Nothing incoming. Skip attack. No, it's not it's not starting a fight yet. I'm being very cautious this game, very, very cautious. Right, so we're going to block uh and we're going to block. You've got to notice that if you actually drag and drop the cards, you don't have to right click, block, and then try and click on something else. So, this seems to be a better way to do it. Just dragging and dropping. Um, shall I block the bird? It doesn't mean wiping out all my own minions. Pretty much. I'm going to go for it. So another mass of ghouls, not really what I was after. What's this? Frostlinks. Could be useful. Turn, but just a turn. Can't attack with that card, unfortunately. This isn't going well, I don't think. Uh, shall we block? The zombies. It's a normal TT card. It's a zombie card. Mm. Kidoki, uh, Death Cultist. Fabulous. I have rubbish cards. I really do. <laughs> I'm not making excuses. Um, I am not doing very well through my own inexperience. See if she'll block that. She's trying to rid one of the minions if she does. She can take the hit herself. Taking the hit. Ethical test. Okay, let's uh, continue. Coming in this time. 
Gonna use the death kill to stop stop that. Where I wish I'd have fired at. <laughs> okay, uh, let's get rid of something. Return to hell. Oh, it's just flesh of dust, it destroys a creature. Let's get rid of that one. Just the grave. I thought it was the one that returns it to your opponent's hand. I just put it in the grave instead. Um, Go for it, what you gonna do? Big block. That's a surprise. Unfortunately. Yeah, we, we, we're not going to win this round. Oh, I'll pull out an all defeating everything card. Which I don't think I've got in the set. Because it's just a box standard set. Uh, creature Zombie. I'll see me Vampire card. Got a water card, okay, so I can't really do anything with that. Uh, attack with Frostlings. She might block, she might just ignore it because she's that far ahead. I could obviously just not do anything, use it to block the cards, but. The indulgent tormentor. Thanks for turning up when I've got three life left. That's really helpful. No, this turn. Thank you very much. It's stay in the game. Oh, I've got these polluted dead things coming in now. Got rid of one of them before, but could have nullified it, I think, if I'd had another water card. Is she not gonna destroy a creature? Right, so ooh. Right. For it to get some creatures out there. I can defend myself with. And then the flyers, I can just hit her in the face for that one. So yeah, I got rid of one of my land cards doing that, but I'm 
didn't have much choice really. Just got me on the ropes a bit. What's this? So I'm going to play that. Get rid of that. And then we're gonna punch her in the face again. Okay, so... Block. 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 Just take two damage and hope nothing else comes through. Really? Okay. Well, I think it's a surprise for me and everyone else that Archie won that with one life remaining. A shocker. A complete shocker. Just shows you how good that card was um, that I got in the booster pack at the end of the tutorial. If you bother to sit through it and wait that long, it was rather long, much longer than I was intending it to be. Um, but there we go, that's uh, the first victory for Draco. Uh, obviously the geekiest name out there, Draco, thank you very much. I am the dragon, literally, with the dragon on the shoulder. Hmm. Cool. I'm sure the Khaleesi would appreciate that, but many people won't. Cool, so, new booster unlocked for Innistrad. Let's see what we got. Ooh, so neutralize. Naturalize even. Let's try to take that fact. That's for green deck. For trees. <laughs> Dead weight. Enchant creature minus two minus two. It's quite useful on so a single cast. Kill things with that. Um would have been very useful in the last battle. Uh and the blind phantasm. Illusion. Also quite a good card though. Well it's three to cast though, so 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 on that one. I like that one though. See, so, yeah, I'm naturally a black deck player. I like debuffing things and then draining people's life. So there we go, that's our first victory off the board. So um thanks for watching that. That'll be the second video and we'll continue playing. If uh, if you're interested in seeing some more, please let me know. But um I'm gonna keep playing this and um please like and subscribe for some more. Thank you very much.